What's up YouTube? In today's video, I will show you how to create a character illustration using the live mirror function in Adobe Illustrator. With the sketch already created in Illustrator, head to the layers panel to create a reference template layer. Create two layers and name them outline and color. By pressing command and control R on your keyboard, you will activate the ruler guides. Click and drag from the right and place the guide in the middle. From there, create a line with the line tool in the middle and have it selected. Go to the object menu and click on repeat and then select mirror. Now we will zoom in and make sure that our line is perfectly centered. Activate the pen tool and from the middle begin outlining the symmetrical parts of the character's face. I'll be using a 5 point stroke with rounded caps and corners. Don't forget that if lines are overlapping, you can select them and activate the Shape Builder tool. Then holding Option or Alt, you can click and delete the unwanted line. Once we are done the symmetrical parts, let's release the mirror function. Select all and go to the menu at the top and select expand. You're then going to right click and ungroup, then select all, right click and release clipping mask. Continue with the rest of the outlining process using the pen tool. Alright, to add the color, let's select all and duplicate the outline onto the color layer. Lock and hide the outline layer for the moment. Now select all and activate the live paint bucket tool. Using the color swatches, just hover over the highlighted areas and apply a base color to the subject. Once we are done, go to the object menu and select expand. Then ungroup twice and remove the line work from the color layer. Let's finish off the illustration by adding shading. By pressing Command or Control Y on your keyboard, you will activate the wireframe view. This view allows us to see where we place the shadows on the sketch. Using the pen tool with a darker shade, we can apply the shadow shapes. Press Command or Control Y again to go back to the regular view, and now we will clean this up by using the Shape Builder. Select all the shadow shapes and the hair shape, then activate the Shape Builder tool. Hold down Option or Alt on your keyboard and click on the exterior shapes to delete them. Following this same method, I will add the remaining shading.
how to create a symmetrical character using the live mirror function in Adobe Illustrator. I hope you enjoyed this video and let me know what you'd like to see next on the channel in the comments below. Cheers everyone!